Hello, and welcome to this video. <laughs> so I asked the people of Twitter what kind of video I should make for Godzilla's birthday. I added the option of bake a Godzilla cake, just for kicks and giggles. Didn't think it would get that many votes, but uh, it ended up getting the most votes. So here we are. I'm not a professional baker, so I don't have all the fancy schmancy tools, so don't come for me. And while I'm doing this, I'm going to read off a couple of tweets. I asked you guys to drop some uh, fun facts and, and or favorite moments. Professor Kaiju 101 says, Very few people know this, but before his rise to fame, Godzilla was a heavy drinker, smoker, and gambler. He has huge amounts of debt and was in deep with the y Yakuza. Ishiro Honda, being a longtime friend, wanted to help him out, and so he offered him the star role in his movie. Oh, that's nice of him. So we're going to be making a chocolate cake. Two third cups of butter softened. Do we have two thirds? Oh well. I wore this shirt specifically for this video. Hardcore fans will know that this is from Godzilla vs. Megalon, one of my favorite movies growing up, which leads me to one of my favorite moments, the drop kick. Everyone loves the drop kick. Do you love the drop kick, hon? Yes. Drop kick. The drop kick is amazing. The drop kick is amazing. Want to do a confetti blast to us? No, no, I don't want to do a confetti blast. <laughs> you know how long it'll take to clean up? Are you kidding me right now? Cream, butter, and sugar until light and fluffy. Five to seven minutes. What do you mean cream butter? Do you mean just like mix it? Because that's that's what I was planning on doing. I'll just go with my normal method of just uh, dump it all in and hope for the best. I'm not doing this for five to seven minutes. Oh. Godzilla himself responded, Fun fact, I feed off radiation, fish, and both the tears and blood of my enemies. I would say that's accurate. So one time, when I was helping my mom bake pie or something for Thanksgiving, like, years ago, when I was like a kid, I was cracking the eggs, and, uh, the shell fell into the bowl, and the yolk fell on the table. So that tells you how experienced I am with baking. Yes, they're all, they're all in the bowl this time. What are some of your favorite Godzilla moments? Yes, you. Well, one of my favorite moments is um, King Kong versus Godzilla. I like that fight battle. Oh, okay, so you just like the entire battle. Yeah. Okay. That's fair. I like that battle too. I think that that movie was this, supposed to be Godzilla versus Frankenstein, which is why King Kong gets that electrical power up towards the end. Which which that never made sense to me as a kid, by the way. Like, okay, so electricity makes him stronger since when? You know, that was actually my first Godzilla movie that I ever saw, King Kong vs. Godzilla. Oh, you know what I forgot? I forgot to grab the flower. Excuse me. I think this is the flower. Yes. Oh, oh this is gonna make all kinds of mess. Alright, hold on. There must be a simpler way to do this. Spoons are for losers. Give me a spoon. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> uh, the bill blocked the shot. Well. I'll just... Whatever. The table is a mess, just like this video. Is that enough flour? Do I need more flour? I might need more, more flour. Here, here we go. There oh, we go. God, there we go. <laughs> well, listen. Listen. It was gonna go in there anyway, one way or the other. <laughs> You're gonna edit that out. Mm-mm. <laughs> <laughs> how many... How many? Shh. I thought you said two thirds. Yeah, this is a one third oh, cup. Okay, okay, okay. I know how to math. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we also need a little bit of salt. 
a teaspoon of salt. Is this a teaspoon? This is a teaspoon. For our next ingredient. Baking soda. We need... Okay. So I think I'm, I'm trying to like think of... <laughs> like I'm trying to like keep this entertaining, but I'm also trying not to like destroy the kitchen. Do you think Godzilla drinks milk? That's how they got so big and strong. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's pull up another tweet. At Kiss You Guys says, Godzilla was really a teenage boy in high school before he was bitten by a radioactive dinosaur. You know, that's a very little known fact. Well, this is very, this is very, okay. I feel like I'm missing some ingredients. Well, I'm not missing ingredient. I just didn't measure it properly. Maybe I need more flour. Should I just dump this whole thing in here? Oh, no, no, no. Why not? Just follow. Obey the recipe. Obey the recipe. Don't tell me how to live my life. <laughs> okay, because this is this is like way loose. Oh man, first we had unboxing the Jenga video, and then unboxing the NECA figures, which I, I haven't released yet, because it's a dumpster fire and I don't want to look at it. Oh, it's a hot mess. Oh, it's a mess. It's a hot mess. <sighs> I don't know. Let me know in the comments if you want to see that video, but I'm I'm telling you, it's not it's not pretty. That's a lot of flour. Yeah, well, I know. I said I was going to make a, a Godzilla cake. I didn't say it was gonna be good. Might not be edible. Might might taste like hot garbage. Did I put sugar in it? I think I put sugar. Should I follow the recipe or just dump it all in and hope for the best? Follow the recipe. I'm gonna dump it all in and hope for the best. No. no I, I, because I see like little sugar sugar bits in here, so maybe I did. This could be disaster. It's already a disaster, so <laughs> it doesn't really matter what I do from here. Uh, this is way too watery. Did I put enough? Did I put enough flour? So I'm just gonna keep adding flour until it's the right consistency, and hopefully it won't taste like garbage. But if it does taste like garbage, it will be very fitting for this year, because this year has been absolute garbage. Is that the right consistency for cake? I oh. Doesn't, no, doesn't, it doesn't, that, no, that, that ain't it. Reading is fundamental, kids. Make sure you get the measurements correct. Let's read a, another tweet. Yes, we're gonna read another tweet. Dennis Smith gave us like an actual fact. The sound effects for the hidden Mecha Godzilla and the breath sound effects are different from the normal Godzilla effects. This was done to help point out that the first Godzilla is actually Mecha Godzilla. What are you laughing at? Breath oh. Effects. Oh. <laughs> breath effects. <laughs> DC Jr. says, Godzilla once hosted the Grammys and gave every award to Corey Hart. <laughs> uh, you know what? I think that's a good consistency. I hope so. Yeah. All right, yeah. That, 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 that looks good. All right, so I think we're at a good consistency. I mean, it, it still looks kind of watery, but... I... 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 Okay. This is going to be the worst chocolate cake ever. You pesky humans, get off my lawn! Alright, so while we're waiting for the cake, let's read a few more tweets. Jordan McCloskey says, my favorite fact is that GMK was originally supposed to have Baron and Anguirus in place of Mothra and King Ghidorah. Hmm. That is an interesting fact. One of my favorite moments is the Mechagodzilla reveal in Godzilla vs. Mechagodzilla. It was just cool to see the, the fight end with Godzilla bleeding. He bleeds a lot in the 70s. The Monster Island Film Vault says, The name Gojira is a portmanteau of the Japanese words gorilla, and whale. 
Also, Godzilla swore as like a sailor according to the Shobijin. Ooh, Godzilla, what a terrible language! All right, so we're just gonna cut to um, when the cake is done cooling so we can put on the icing. One eternity later. So the cakes are cooled. And I put, them, put one of them on this uh, spinny thing that I got specifically for this video. This is the fun part. For my next trick, I'm going to attempt to write on the cake, legibly. How's it going? Not well. We should have started like a little higher. Yeah. Whatever. It's, it's harder not, than it yeah, looks. Yeah, it's not easy to. You gotta give props to people that do that when you when you do yeah. that ice cream shop or bakery and say, can you put happy birthday on this? It's not easy. Wow. I never thought, I never, I, wow. Oh, do I have enough, do I have enough gel for this? Because I still have to write Godzilla. <laughs> this is, this is just not, this is not working out well for me. <laughs> so far I have happy birthday go. <laughs> what if I just wrote Gojira, Gojira, that's less letters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. What if his name isn't Godzilla because Godzilla is the name that the people on Odo Island gave him? What if his, what if his real name is Bob, right? Wait. Yay! It looks terrible. Thanks, I hate it. <laughs> All right, now for the cake tacos. Finish it off. We got Godzilla Earth here, and a favorite, Godzilla 2000, Burning Goji. Uh, Shin Goji is missing an arm, should I put him on anyway? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Just because he's missing an arm doesn't... Yeah, let's give him some love. Miss that arm. Okay. Yeah, let's give, let's give him some love. For one more. Yay! Okay. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen, a Godzilla birthday cake. Yes. <laughs> Alrighty. Thank you so much for watching and making me do this. All right, so subscribe to my channel for more kaiju content. Like this video if you had a good time with me here today. And be sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram to get an idea of what I have coming up next. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Uh, uh.